being here once I find it. I think I got it wrong, but I don't know. Like it's always hard to get it to be. Okay, sweet vanilla. If you have it on your phone, you will definitely check. Some people think press M and then it's going to bring up this thing. Now that this has happened, you want to make sure you download this thing. This is Good morning! Welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time you're seeing me, thank you so much for clicking this video and wanting to watch it. And if you're a returning subscriber, huge love to you guys. Thank you so much for supporting my channel. This is a new year. Well, those of you who haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing and joining the family. I realized that over 70% of my subscribers or of my watchers are not subscribed to my channel, which makes me wonder if you guys are monitoring spirit. So don't be a monitoring spirit so we're entering a new year. So we have entered a new year. So new year resolution should be to engage with content. Anyways, if this is the first time you're seeing me, my name is Adobe Okonkwa Bakoro. I am a Nigerian content creator who is based in Dallas, Texas. I also work as a product marketing manager at a tech company. It has been an awesome experience thus far. Yesterday was new year. Today is January 2nd and I just woke up really excited about the year. So today is work day. So obviously this video is going to be about a day in the life as a product marketing manager. And I have a couple of things that I need to knock off my list and I'll be creating my to-do list later after I've had my cup of coffee so that is just an aside so yesterday we spent new year with my in-laws and my husband I made jello fries and the most awesome chicken I've ever tasted in my life Loki it was really good I'm not like gaslighting myself it tasted really really good it was a great hangout today I am going to be working tomorrow is my midpoint connect if you're new to my channel midpoint connect is sort of a performance review that we have at the midpoint point of our rotation so like I told you guys I'm currently in a rotational program um, so every four months for three times I am going to be in a different role I'm currently in my second role as a relationship marketer and I'm working on an email campaign which is such a great learning experience I've never done an email campaign as detailed as this so it's definitely a great learning opportunity so that's what I have going on today I have to review my manager's feedback so the one I have for him share with my program manager and then I need to also review the content brief that I told you guys that I'm working on share that with my manager and um, yeah and then Thursday we're going to do like a detailed review content brief and hopefully fingers crossed we won't have there won't be a lot of feedback I know it's definitely going to have feedback but it won't be I don't know these days anytime I just hear that sound on my computer my heart just literally skips a bit because I'm like can you guys just allow me breathe small we just resumed who is sending me a message like literally the morning of when I'm just trying to like arrange all of my emails and stuff. Yeah, I'll check that out later. So I'm gonna go downstairs, make a cup of coffee, and then I'll be back to get started on my to-do list before do doing anything on my laptop. I like creating my to-do list first because it just sets me up for success throughout the rest of the day and also don't forget the things that I'm supposed to do. So rather than just jumping in and starting work, I only do the latter when the stuff that I'm supposed to deliver, I need to deliver it in the next five minutes. Right now, I don't think anything is super important. So I'm I'm going to do my to-do list first um later in the afternoon lunch break i'm going to go down to my gym center my membership expired and i was just waiting for the new year to start so i can have like new benefits and i can use my pex plus which is an allowance they give us to pay for my gym membership that was what well, one thing i wanted to do one thing i also wanted to add i was an, at an event like two days ago and i met this girl who was telling me about is it active fit or something so you basically pay a lower fee for that so instead of i don't know how much like my gym membership is I think maybe $35 or something but they charge $32 so that's like $3 saving multiply that by 12 and that's like a huge saving however you have to pay a $32 enrollment fee which just sucks so I have to go to the gym see what the calculation is and then do my own calculation with that app I'm gonna put the name here once I find it I think I got it wrong but I'll put the right name here and see which one will give me the most <laughs> the highest amount of savings I don't want to waste money guys so and I wish we could pay 
I could pay like six months. I think you have to do it on a monthly basis. So that's just one disadvantage uh, because I would need to file for reimbursement. That means every month I'm going to be filing for reimbursement all the way to the end. I don't want to do that. I would rather just pay upfront and then get reimbursed for that upfront, if that makes sense. I'm excited about the year. I am full of energy. There's so many things I need to do this year. And by God's grace, we're going to all achieve all of our goals this year. So enough ch chatting. We're going to go downstairs and make a cup of coffee. Before I do that, just because of my, I just want to make sure the message that came in is not super important before I go down and make my coffee. But yeah, I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm excited. First, I'm going to fill up my water. guys this were the chicken i made yesterday and it tasted so freaking good let me give you guys the quick recipe so i marinated no i boiled it first with all sorts of seasoning and when it was done i brought it out and i sprayed suya powder on it and i just shook it to make sure that the sugar <laughs> suya powder really coated the chicken and then i air roasted it with my air fryer and it came out this way oh my god literally the best tasting chicken that i've ever made now i'm beginning to think okay i like chicken thighs better than drumsticks now so and this chicken i got from costco has to be the best tasting chicken because all the other chicken that i usually would get would always be i don't know like it's always hard to get it to be tasting nice if that makes any sense so i'm just happy that this one tasted good and you know hoso now costco sells hoso so i had to buy like a pack of it and a pack of it is i believe six or eight so four four and i think i used two packs which had like four pieces of chicken so in total eight or ten maybe so i also ordered some nespresso pods and i was gonna order two and then they said for me to get 10 percent off i have to buy five guess what i did i bought five and i got two samples and a free recycle recycling bag which is awesome i'm going to show you the flavors that i got and then would we'll be testing out one i'm actually of the opinion that i should finish the one that i have so remember the nespresso machine came with three pods and i've been trying them and that's when i discovered that i actually like two of the flavors one is called melozio and then the other one is called chiaro those ones taste so good they're really nice for making like lattes and like all of those starbucks drinks and then i got um some actual flavor coffee uh sweet vanilla something caramel and then i got one for making iced coffee you want to get one for iced coffee just because i feel like when you add ice to your coffee it dilutes it a little bit so this is more concentrated than, than the others at least to the best of my understanding and knowledge so let me show you the, the flavors i got <laughs> okay so this one is golden caramel I heard this one tasted so good so really excited to try that out and then once i've done once i've like tasted all of them i would now know for sure which ones i'll be getting on a regular basis this is double espresso dolce i heard this is really good for making lattes so your starbucks lattes really good for that and then this is sweet vanilla deuce okay sweet vanilla yeah uh, a few people had sentiments about this one that like doesn't really vanilla island but um we're gonna give it a try and see and then we have this one. Ooh, this is my favorite for making lattes it would taste so freaking good i made one um using my caramel soda caramel syrup i'm gonna show you guys how i make it and then we have the ice legaro for making your eyes coffee so those are all the ones that i got just gonna put them here once i finish the ones in my jar i'm going to then i'm going to then refill those ones up but this these are the two samples they oops it came in so two samples this is bianco dobio and then this is bianco piccolo interesting names so i'm gonna put this two here because i want to remember to try them out and i have a few more samples in here um i'm gonna be trying bianco dobio because it says milk so we're gonna see how it tastes i'm gonna finish up this one first before i go and start using the new one i didn't even gist you guys the day i went to home goods to buy a jar the jar i wanted to buy was actually bigger than this but i feel like this is a perfect size for this space but i actually broke one of the the jar that i wanted to pick up and it was just so funny luckily they didn't ask me to pay for it they just picked up the deck maybe because they didn't even find me because immediately i broke it i just moved all the broken pieces to one side around 
run away <laughs> okay so we're gonna go ahead and get started with our coffee i still have some water this cup is actually too big for this space so i'll fix that later but come let me show you guys how i make it I feel like it's gonna be slightly too sweet because of the camera that I added at the bottom. Oh. This is so good. I think I like Bianco W. Oh, so good. Oh. Mm -mm -mm -mm. It's so good. This coffee is so good. I literally feel like taking some more. I love coffee, but I don't like how it makes me feel when I take a lot of it. So I need to find out if Nespresso has like some decaf coffee that still tastes like coffee, but doesn't have that, like, you know, thing that makes you feel jittery. So that's what I'm going to be doing. Let's go upstairs and get some work done. I'll get started with our day. <sighs> now that I've had my cup of coffee, I just feel unstoppable. <laughs> But now you're gone. Okay guys, so I oh, absolutely love this coffee. I'm going to try to finish it before it gets cold because I find that anytime my coffee gets cold, I don't, I'm unable to like really digest it just because, I don't know, if it's not iced, it tastes very different. So now that we have some caffeine in our body, I'm going to go ahead and create my to-do list. That's the first thing I like to do in the morning. Actually, before that, I'll just take a quick run on my email and just make sure that there's nothing super important that I need to respond to. And that's because I don't have any of my work stuff on my phone. And I do that specifically because of work-life balance. I don't, because if I have it on my phone, I'm going to be checking it and I don't want to be checking it. So I, at one point before I started my job, I was torn between like buying a new phone specifically for work. <laughs> and I decided that I don't want to be carrying two phones and I don't want to be thinking about work when I'm off work. So it just made sense to not have it on any of my personal stuff and i think that's something everybody needs to do because if you have it on your phone you would definitely check some people think oh it's convenient you know you can go out and do stuff and still be able to check your email that makes sense but ultimately i feel like if you are at work then you should not be going and be doing all of this like just focus on work you can take one hour break and go and do what you want to do make sure you put it on your status that okay you're out for an appointment you're going to be back so so time because it just helps like your mental health you can you can be juggling a lot of stuff at the same time so i'm going to go ahead actually the first thing that is priority for me right now is my youtube video so that is supposed to go live 12 noon today so i'm just going to go in and make sure that you know everything is set i already did the description the tagging it was processing this morning so i want to make sure that we now have like higher quality which is like 4k so yes yeah, so this is now available and oh my gosh i love the quality of my videos now it's just giving it's giving what it's supposed to give to be honest i'm gonna go ahead and let me show you guys oh no that's the wrong way to... i'm gonna go ahead and um make this schedule this for today to go live 12 noon today so second i am so grateful for chat gpt because i don't think there's any way i would have sat down and be typing this description what i now do is i would have the key ha highlights and then i would just put it in chat gpt and ask it to come up with an seo description description for my youtube video and it will do all of the work and i just need to read through and make sure it's not incorporating anything that doesn't need to be incorporated it's looking good i've scheduled that one quick tip that i want to show you guys is on final cut pro let me tell you let me give you the problem statement you're editing your video you are now ready to publish it it goes to your youtube video uh, channel it's uploaded and now you need to put your timestamps your chapter chapter mark and you now have to like go back and like watch it do the timestamp manually and then put it girl i have a trick for you and let me show you so i'm going to bring you guys closer and show you how i do that um since we're doing quick tip january okay um just stop it there so for example, this is what you do. Say this part now from where this red headline is, you're talking about an intro. So you just press M, you press M, and then it's gonna bring up this thing here. So what you basically do is double click it twice and now write intro, right? 
and you want to make sure you put this so this is chapter and then this is marker marker means um you're just marking a spot so that you go back and like maybe do something to it i've never used this part here but this is what you want to do and then when you do that you're going to see this red thing come up that's how you know it's in chapter and clearly you can see it looks like a bookmark icon so you click done now that this has happened you want to make sure you download this thing this thing is called creator's best friend ex extension yeah it's called creator's best friend this one here it is so freaking good what you basically want to do is grab this video here you can see you just grab and then you dump it here it takes a few minutes oh so you need to have enough marker left right i'm just putting random stuff because i want to show you how it's done um i'm not sure what the limit is but okay apparently three is the minimum um so once you've done that you can see it literally copied it i didn't need to do anything one thing you need to do is and sometimes it will automatically do it for you but just make sure you do it all the way from the beginning so here is usually where i would have like my my montage so i'll just put a, a a chapter mark there and call it montage so that instead of start it's going to say montage okay and once you've done that you just basically copy you go to your video description here uh let's say this is the video that i want to um i want to add it to just go in there and you just control v and can you see it just added that so because i that's not what i want to do i am just going to undo changes and then go back to my youtube okay so how much are you guys going to pay me for that tip because <laughs> i realized that i spent a lot of time trying to always include the timestamps, and it was just the least favorite part of my work because i have to watch the video and then start marking each of the seconds writing it manually it was just a huge hassle and i really wanted to include chapters because many of my videos are long i acknowledge that and even i appreciate when people include timestamps, so i can just move to parts that interest me do you understand what i mean so yeah i'm excited about the video that's going live today i feel like it's looking clean it's like that's the quality i want to maintain so let's do our to-do list i like to just go through my previous list and see if there's anything i forgot to do so today is what january 2nd oh actually i should i usually start with the day instead of the year so i'm gonna just use this i'm gonna tell you that i love you so guys i have done my to-do list and you guys can see it's pretty <laughs> full and that's because you know day after the holiday is usually the most busiest or the busiest and i'm just trying to knock out as much as possible ahead of tomorrow and then i'm meeting with my manager on thursday i have my midpoint tomorrow so i just want to make sure that we're in good standing so the first thing i have on my list here is to review my manager's feedback and then share it with my business program manager who would then share it with my manager so once i've done that i'll review the content brief and then share it with my manager uh though for the competition we did an, uh, an online game that we did for Africans at my uh, at my workplace. I told you that I'm Koli. So we had three winners, and I'm just going to disperse Amazon gift cards of twenty five dollars to each of them. There are three of them, and then I'll take a break and then go to the gym and fix my gym membership and compare the prices. Because me, I'm all about saving coins. So anywhere I can save coins, girl, you're gonna find me there. I'm gonna also complete my next level for my um, real estate course because the goal is to complete it. Achieve and next week. Oh my gosh, literally saying it's it's next week. I I need to do i need to complete our itinerary design it and share it with my husband so he has it because it's very forgetful and i'm going to reply the result email they were asking a couple of questions um i'm planning like a nice couple massage for both of us and then i'm also planning um, like an adventure thing so i need to fill the form and let them know book bus service for my arrival and my husband's arrival and then us now coming back together then i need to figure out how to buy retina so i'm going to call ire who traveled on one time and ask him how he got it then Jan January monthly reset I need to break down my 2024 goals into monthly buckets and then um, maybe even film like my January monthly reset maybe not today maybe at the end of the month or something but that's what I want to have but I'll tell you guys a few of the goals once I've done that I need to do some house chores the kitchen is a mess because after yesterday I was just knocked out I was so tired I went to sleep and, and then foundational plan I need to review that and then share it with my colleague he wanted to figure out like how does it work you know relationship marketing and stuff so there's an there's a little excel 
worksheet that I have where I'm tracking all of the process step by step. I'm, I'm just going to share with him and during my next one on one with him, which is next week, would we'll then review it. I will just walk him through what that is. So that is pretty much what I have on my list. I am just going to go ahead and be fixing this as I go. First and foremost, I need to join all my bank. My credit card is expiring, I think this month or something. So I need to verify, then verify. Okay. Good, good. Oh, thank you so much. Uh, thanks to I Buy Direct, <laughs> literally a lifesaver. Yeah. Yes. Oh my gosh. Yes. And they always have cute stuff. Oh, yeah. Oh my God, what brings you in today? Mm, I have um um. So I received an email just literally a few minutes ago. Update my address. So oh, sure. just gonna okay. type it in the chat. Um, as you guys already know, I like dividing my desktop in this format. So here I would have my email, at the bottom I'll have my Teams, and then I'll have two browsers on because I usually multitask. And then sometimes I would have my OneNote on one side as well. But OneNote is something that I hardly use. So, oh gosh, I love this bank so much. Um, they are literally so freaking efficient. So I'm going to start off with my feedback. Now I'm looking for it. It's just strange. Um, okay, I I'll miss you if you go. Yes, I'm going to let you know just how much I tell you. finished reviewing my manager's feedback i'm just going to send it to my business program manager oh no 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 i made a mistake i put e1 instead of e2 so because the content brief i probably need to spend some more time on it i would be doing that one last but i'm going to start working on the gift cards because they're already messaging me people like free things so i'm going to start off with the gift card and i'll be doing that on my phone because she has the lady has zelled me the money that i'm going to dispose so i just need their emails and then i'll purchase the amazon gift cards so let's see They came. Um, it, it was this the guy that was charging you? Uh, so we're going to lock it. In the meantime, I have the gift cards now on my Amazon account or our family Amazon account mostly my husband's account. What I'm going to basically do is I would just go ahead and purchase it on here. So I'm going to select all and then I already make sure that the emails are right. So just going to uncheck and then select just the ones that I'm interested in. I hope they don't charge me for this gift cards though. Okay, $75. Let's use I'm just gonna go ahead and purchase it. So I'm just gonna go ahead and place the order. Are that placed? I'm gonna take a screenshot and I'm going to send this. I just bought it and I sent a screenshot of it to my work email. Now I'm gonna take a screenshot of that and send to the person who sent me the money to this boss so she has it as evidence that I've done it. And then I will let the guys know that, that it has been done and it should arrive in their mailboxes in five minutes. That's how much I'm gonna tell you that I want you. I want to let you know. Yeah, so, uh-huh. What time is your flight on Thursday? Happy New Year everyone. So there's this Nespresso machine that I've been eyeing. I am gonna take a quick break and go downstairs. My video is premiering, so I wanna go watch it on the big TV. TV is on and we're gonna just watch me on TV. Looking fire, like 
like skin is popping. You know what it is. Happy New Year first and foremost. And secondly, add to your New Year's resolution to subscribe and uh, watch her videos from start to finish. All right? Six people are currently watching it. And it makes me so, so happy. I am going to, I have, I feel like I have so many things to do. I was on my way to book um, a flight, not a flight, a uh, transportation. So while this is going on, I'm going to, geez, why am I out of breath? I need to get back to the gym. What are the other? Yeah, I'm just doing one by one. I just booked one for um, uh, uh, Okay. Yeah. Yeah, guys, it's it's freaking cold, so I'm gonna put on my jacket. Like the minute I stepped out in the cold that just hits me, it was just mm, it's giving too cold honey it's giving too cold guys i've missed going to the gym uh, i've literally missed it so freaking much so i'm just excited to just pay this and then get back into my fitness era luckily i haven't added a lot of pounds back and that's thanks to the medication that i was at the gym hopefully there's somebody in there because when i called earlier nobody hey hi are you my person no i'm not oh, okay <laughs> yeah i am actually here to renew my gym okay that's not me that's me so i just arrived and i'm just waiting for her to be done so i can see her behind me she's attending to another customer so i'm actually going to try and see if i can get a discount because as a faithful gym girl gotta try okay so fingers crossed Happy New Year. Happy. Yeah. So my membership looks like it ended. Um, Twelve months. Yeah, but I don't want to use everything up at the same time. So until June, right? So let's see. Twelve is happening. Okay. Let me try to calculate how much I'm saving if it makes sense. So it's thirty-two times six. Okay, so I just went and asked her uh, the last question that I had and she was nice enough to answer. So I'm going to start heading home and once I get home, that will be the first thing I would do. I would uh, enroll. I have to pay on a monthly basis, which isn't bad because that means that, you know, if I decide that this month I'm not going to be going to the gym, I can just cancel it. But how do I then get reimbursed? so i can get like the full amount and just know that i'm just paying on let's go back you guys can tell that my glasses are the polarized so it basically goes black and becomes a sunglass when i'm outside when there's sun and when there's no sun it just turns transparent so looks like my manager sent me a message um
in-laws. <laughs> I forgot whether to say parental, but it's just in-laws. So in-laws and my husband. Um, it went really well. So this information, thanks for sharing this with me. So that's it's already there. And then we have sort of the swan. So I already confirmed with um, Philip. like she declined it so i'm basically done for the day the next thing i'm doing now is just um sending perspective requests to my colleagues perspective request is when you are seeking feedback on how your on your collaboration skills with people on your team so this is needed for our as part of our final connect so i'm going to i just selected a few people that i've worked closely with okay guys so with that i am pretty much done for the day i am just going to take a break it's been a long day um for me i haven't eaten as well throughout the whole day i think the coffee i had i have just finished for the day i feel like today went really well it was a bit slow but i'm glad that i was able to get everything done that is pretty much everything that i had on my list i am officially done for the day i hope you guys enjoyed all of the work i tried to tell you guys as much as much as i could mm. i'm so tired man chicken the chicken tastes so good But I hope you all enjoyed today's video and I hope you found it insightful somehow and I hope you subscribe and join the family. Please help get me to a thousand subscribers and help get my channel monetized. I did notice that some of you, you guys are cursing me, heartbreak. 73.6% of you all are not subscribed and why? I don't know so please join the family um and turn on the post notification bell so you all will be notified every time i have a new video up on my channel i hope you guys enjoyed this video enough to give me a thumbs up like this video most importantly share with your friends it will mean the whole world to me and comment down below so let's see let's comment pink cat emoji in the in the comment section below that way i know that you guys watch this video up to this point I do apologize if we found it too long, but there are timestamps, so you can definitely go to any section of the video that might have interested you. Um, I'm so excited about the week. Tomorrow is my midpoint. I'll let you guys know how it goes when I'm filming my Thursday's vlog or Friday's vlog, but I'll keep you all posted. So I'll see you all in my next one. Bye.